What's going on guys? It is Dan with Right Now Powder Coating and we are going to be doing another two-tone video. So let's go ahead and get into it. All right guys, so these are the wheels we are doing. They are already pre-blasted. Uh, we are going to be doing a chrome face. So on the lips and the flat pieces here and then a Kingsport Gray from Prismatic in the pocket. So right now we've got them all hanging. We've got the chrome powder in. That guy there, he's gonna put the powder down and uh, we're Hi, gonna... Mom. Hi, Mom. Yeah. If your mom watches these, we're in trouble. <laughs> um, I don't know why I drink sometimes. Uh, sometimes. Sometimes. Anyways, so we're gonna do the chrome. We're gonna do a full cure on it so that it doesn't lift or anything into the second coat and then we're going to do the king sport then clear coat so do it get to work are you cool enough to do it yet i don't know okay. i'm gonna do it anyway All right, so we've got the IFS Extreme Chrome bonded on the wheels. This is actually a pretty good chrome, I think. Um, they look pretty good. So we're going to take the King Sport. We're going to spray it on the entire wheel. We're going to focus on these pockets on the backs, the drum, and then on the back side to get it all covered. Um, that will be our main coverage for everything and then we'll do our two-tone vacuum slash finger wipe on the face to clean up all that and just leave those pockets. So let's get going. All right guys, so we got the wheels covered now with the Kingsport Gray. We're only gonna be leaving the pockets. So the lip here and the face, that's all gonna be um, removed. We've got our shot vac here. 
And then we actually just 3D printed a piece right here that go, it was a little bit thin, so we taped it, that goes to this connection of this hose, which we, believe it or not, that's the end of a pin. We're gonna see how it works. I haven't ever done this yet. We've used other attachments, but this should be really, really fine, so we'll see how it works.
All right, so there is one wheel done. We got four more, to, or three more, I can't do math. Four more to go, three more to go. Three, three wheels. I feel like four more, it's a very tedious process. So we're gonna be very careful because I don't want to spray more powder up in the air to fix something because then it could possibly get back on this one. And then I got to rewipe all of that again. So I'm going to keep on going. We're just going to speed through this. All right, so we got the wheels back out. The two-tone looks pretty good on it. We're gonna go ahead and clear coat it because you have to clear over the chrome and it's not a bad practice to clear over metallic. So we're gonna clear coat these, which will dole it out a little bit, but it should still look pretty good. Um, and that's basically it. So it's just a lot of painstaking attention to detail work. We got it done though. Um, I think the customer's gonna be thrilled with these. Let's get these in clear and see what they look like. All right guys, these wheels are done. Uh, you're gonna be amazed. I have been staring at these things ever since they came out of the oven. They look phenomenal. Uh, very, very happy with it. Uh, before we show those off though, please make sure to subscribe. Make sure to check out our join for our membership feature here and on Patreon, the links are down below. Um, check out our Amazon links. All of that stuff helps us, gives us more motivation to help you guys. Uh, if you're a member, you're getting your answers. Uh, if you have questions and such, I may not answer them if you just leave them on the comments. Sometimes I do, sometimes I don't, but you will get your answer. We, we support the people that support us, so make sure you check those out. But let's get to it. Let's check these 
wheels out. I'm gonna do it up close for you guys so you can really see how it turned out. And as always, thanks for watching. We'll catch you guys on the next one.